Hey guys, it's Sparky129 here, and welcome back to Pokemon Sword, completing the living decks we have. Today, we are finishing up catching the last of the Johto Pokemon we need, except for the legendaries, at least in Pokemon Sword. So, first up, I've already got a list of what I need in this game, again, excluding the legendaries. First up is Dunsparce which apparently is in soothing wetlands in any, supposedly any weather, so let's go find it. Oh, done, Sparse! Ah, oh, Wupa, not you. Go away. Oh wait, it's in the oval, oh. So it's not wandering, it's in, it's in the grass. What am I doing? What am I talking about? Oh, I think I just found it and it ran away. Alright, let's find it then. There's one, there's one, there's one. There you are. Done, sparse. You're mine now. Alrighty. Let's try a quick ball first, shall we? Quick ball! Oop! Maybe, maybe not. One, two, three. Yeah, got it. That's Duns Pass Court. I'm going the wrong thing. Alright, now we need to check who's next. Ah, Dunsparce the Land Snake Pokemon. This Pokemon's tiny wings have some scientists saying that Dunsparce used to fly through the sky in ancient times. Very interesting. Send to a box. <laughs> okay, next up is Skarmory, and I know exactly where that is. Hello, what do you want? Sorry guys, I'm really used to the uh, violet controls. Less chancy at least. Hi Skarmory, please come here. Yes, come here, thank you. Alrighty, let's try a quick ball again. Shall we? I like using me some quick balls. That's two. That's three. And... Caught it. Yeah. There we are. We caught ourselves a Skarmory. Nope, nope, nope. Don't learn coil. Okay, I did not read that, I'm sorry guys, I probably should have, but anyway, doesn't matter. I just thought Don's Passes was a bit interesting, that's all. So now, we have to check out Honeycomb Sea, to see if we have the right weather for Kingdra. Honeycomb Sea is not Thunderstorm. I'll see if I can catch anything else right now with this weather. So, Slippery Slope and frost field point, frost point Field. That's Snow Slide Slope. Three Point Pass, Roaring Sea Caves, Frigid Sea. That's Slippery Slope. And that's Frost Point Field. Okay, Freezing Turn! It's only going to be in random in those places. But let me double check the weather just in case for Slippery Slope first. It is snowing. Yep, that's good. And Frost Point Field is Snowstorm. That's good. So, which one is better? 
Yeah, it doesn't matter. Let's go to Frostpoint. No, we'll see. Slippery Slope. So let's go north. And let's find a grassy patch to find ourselves a smoochum in. Speaking of which, there's one right here. That's not a uh, smoochum. Oh, second try. Perfect. Excellent. Alright, hello Smoochum, please come to me. <coughs> of course it was. Um, I will use a quick ball for you, just in case. I bet it will catch, but we'll see. Fine. Oh, okay, I'm wrong. Oh no! Okay, well... I've, I'm definitely on a time limit now. Please hit the first time. I'm not even going to try it. No. Ah. Smooch him. Stop making this harder than it needs to be. Okay, so. Hypnosis. Please put it to sleep. Thank you. You wasted a turn missing. And let's try and use Great Ball straight up. Because it will kill itself in a second. And I'll be able to encounter one immediately, but um, at the same time, I'd rather not take the chance. I guess Great Ball it is. Okay, that's not a guaranteed catch, so let's see. No! And we're both gone. Alrighty! Bye, Smoochum. I guess I'll see you again next time. Alright, I'll then. There you are! Hi, Smoochum. You better catch the first time, then. I don't want to deal with Perishong again. So, come on. Be a good little Pokemon and get in the quick ball. You better stay in. Come on! No! Bloody hell. Yes, good, you hit the first time. I have two extra turns for this. Well, okay, so... I have a couple of turns for Perish Song to do its thing. Before I have no reason to catch it anymore. So, Great Ball, come on! Please! One. Damn it. This is the last turn. Alright, I need to catch it. Come on. Stay in the Pokeball. Great ball, whatever it is. One. Two. Three. Yes, got it! Yes! Excellent! Finally, thank you. If its face get easy, gets even slightly dirty, Smoochum will bathe immediately. But if its body gets dirty, its body gets dirty, Smoochum doesn't really seem to care. Alrighty then, send to a box, stupid thing. Alright, next up is Elekid, and hopefully those places have some so for form of thunderstorm, hopefully. Okay, some of those are in the, uh, Crown Tundra. So, Giant's Bed... ...is raining, so that's a no. Old Cemetery is raining, that's a no. Giant's Foot is snowing, that's a no. Frigid Sea 
is normal weather, so that's a no. Three point pass is normal weather, so that's a no. And Balimia Lake is intense weather, so no. So, can I catch Magby in now's weather? Uh, slippery slope I know is not intense weather. Yep, there it is. Uh, frost point, all intense sun by the way, so frost point field, no. Giant's bed, no. Old cemetery, no. Snow slide slope, no. Giant's foot, no. Three point pass, normal weather, it's close. Ballymere Lake, yes. So let's go and catch ourselves a Magby. Ballymere Lake, alright, so it's random in the grass. Let's just go here for now. Not my junior. There you are. Hello, Magby. Alrighty, now we can begin. I've seen like, literally everything else except for Magby and Munchlax. That was annoying. Quick ball! Please catch the first time. Ooh, that's a guaranteed. Hopefully. And... No! No! That was my first time it failed! Magby, how dare you! Fine, you wanna play that game? Go to sleep. Ah. What's Loki gonna do, honestly? Anyway, hypnosis. Come on! Ay ay ay. Why don't you hypnosis it yet? Thank you. Thanks, Ged. Sometimes you're a moron. Anyway. Let's just start chucking balls at it, shall we? Just for the color coordination, Pokeball. Shall we? One, two, three. Ah, I thought you kind of liked calling my own Pokemon a moron. Didn't you like that, Magby, or are you fast asleep? All right, please catch this time. One. Nope. Okay. It's still sleeping though, so that's good. Babies like to sleep. Isn't that fun? Alright, another Pokeball, let's go. Let's see. One, two. Nope. It'll wake up. It will. It's already sunny. Okay, do not insult the Magby. It doesn't. It likes me insulting my own Pokemon, it does not like me insulting it. So Magby, come on, please be a sweet baby and come with me. We all know babies are not sweet. They just do their own thing. That's all children do. Anyway, Pokeball. Nope. Not even one. Oh, come on. Fine. Yeah, just weaken it. Why not? That's better. Hey, it doesn't do that much. Excellent. So, hypnosis again. Good, you hit the first time. This time. Good. Alrighty. Let's throw another Pokeball at it then. Alright, this had better capture. This had better capture. Thank you. Good, good, good. There we are. And now, Magby, the live coal Pokemon. This Pokemon is still small and timid. Whenever Magby gets excited or surprised, flames leak from its mouth and its nose. I see. Good, I wanted the Magmarizer. And now, before we start changing dates, now it's time to find Blissey. 
Now, as anything in the Isle of Armor, fog. It's basically anywhere, right? So, Fields of Honor first. Nope. Um, Soothing Wetlands. Nope. Alright, has anywhere got fog, actually? No. Stepping Stone Sea, Stepping Stone Sea area too. What? So there's no place here with fog. Okay, so now... I believe these three Pokemon... Well, two of them need to be caught in the uh, Isle of Armor. And one of them needs to be caught in the Crown Tundra. So let's fly here for now, the Field of Honor, at this place. We will heal up, we'll save, and then we'll do some date skipping. For any of the three. All three, actually. We'll see. So we're going to save here, and then we're going to do some date skipping. And hopefully we will see which one appears first. So wish me luck. Okay, I finally got a place to actually catch something. Frigid Sea has Thunderstorm, which means we can go and catch an Elekid now. Let's go and get that. Now it's going to be random in the grass. Got it. Here's some random in the grass. Let's go find it, shall we? Alright, that's a no. There it is! Finally an Elekid! Well, we found it, now we catch it. Let's throw out a Quick Ball then, shall we? Alright, not a critical- not a critical capture. One, two... Three... Got it! Elekid was caught! Excellent! And there we go! So, what does Elekid's Pokedex entry say? When a storm approaches, this Pokemon gets restless. Once Elekid hears the sound of thunder, it gets full-on rowdy. Alrighty then. To a box you go, thank you. Let's save quickly, because that's Elekid Court. There's still two more we need to get. So let's go over to here. Get Hydro Pump. Let's get some Watts quickly, and then we'll keep date skipping a bit. All right, let's keep going then. Ooh. We have fog in the um, Loop Lagoon. Is Loop Lagoon a thing? Yes, it is. So let's go and catch ourselves a Blissey. Okay, so it's gonna be in the overworld, let's see. 
as a Blissey. No, what I was saying, not Blissey, Weekly Tough. Oop, I see you. Diglett. Six more? Okay, so let's go into the middle here. Yeah, let's go in the middle here. Let's see what there is. Sandy Ghast everywhere. Wiggly Tough again. I thought I saw uh, Jiggly get Jigglet again, so apparently not. Zoroark! Whoa, I did not know you were here. Ah, I don't want that. I didn't know a Zoroark could be there. What? Uh, what else? Uh, let's go to this area over here. It says Blissey's in the overworld in fog, so let's see if it's here. Palisand, okay. See, Diglett. Diglett, Diglett, Diglett. Thank you. And... That is a no, apparently. Oh wait, overworld, it's grass. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see. So let's go all around here and try and find one, shall we? Ignoring the Zoroark, thank you. I'll show you the obvious when I see it. There's one! Hello, Blissey! Welcome! I hope you catch the first time. I really hope so. But I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, let's do a quick ball, shall we? Alright, not critical capture. One, two, three. Gotcha! Good. Now we finally got a Blissey. Even though you technically have one in Violet. But anyway, that's beside the point. Whenever a Blissey finds a weakened Pokemon, it will share its egg and offer its care until the other Pokemon is all better. Very nice, thank you Blissey. So now, we need to stay in the uh, Isle of Armor for one single Pokemon. And that is Kingdra in Honeycomb Sea. I'll fly there so I can go to the island at least. Because there I'll be very close. Alright, Honeycomb Island. Hi Combi. You're male. So I think I will go about here. Save, and then we'll keep date skipping until we get a thunderstorm in the Honeycomb Sea. So wish me luck! Didn't take that much longer, but thunderstorm in the honeycomb sea. Let's go and see it then, shall we? Let's find ourselves a Kingdra! Fine, go away, Sharpedo. Whatever. Anyway. Did I see something over here? Ah, that's a shark, you know. I wonder 
if it'll be around here. I know Cedra was around here that one time I tried finding it. I wonder. There he is! Kingdra, hello! You're the last one we need for this video, so welcome! Alrighty! So, let's use our trusty quick ball, shall we? That's not a critical capture, will it catch? One. Nope, it won't. Alrighty. Now, I wonder, is it protected from sleeping? That's what I'm wondering about. Brain, of course, and electric terrain. Won't fall asleep. Alright then, that explains everything. Of course you do that, why wouldn't you? Please don't though, I'd rather you not. Laser focus, got it. Wasn't sure what they did, now I know, now I know. Critical hit. Most likely. That was a critical hit. Really? Wow. Anyway. Great ball, here I come. Not critical capture, but... One. Nope. Although, isn't it just... Just sleeping? It's like, it's still paralyzed, can't I? Do I have anything that can paralyze it? Nope. Never mind. Let's just keep throwing Pokeballs then. Another great ball. And got out straight away. Of course, Dragon Dance. Why wouldn't you? Of course. Alright, great ball. Again. Come on, stay in. One, two. Damn it. Alright, Hydro Pump, of course. Of course, what else did I expect? Alright, great ball. Again. Not critical capture, unfortunately. One. Two. Three. Gotcha! We got our Kingdra. Excellent. Thank you. And thanks, Kubfu. I guess. Kingdra, the dragon Pokemon. With the arrival of a storm at sea, this Pokemon will show itself on the surface. When a Kingdra and a Dragonite meet, a fierce battle ensues. Okay then. And that's our Kingdra Court. Excellent. So that is it now. That is it for this episode. So now we can go to Pokemon Home. Shall we? Hey guys, welcome back to Pokemon Home. We've got a few Pokemon to put in the box today. And I'm glad we found all of them. I'm really glad about that. Like, really happy. Alrighty. Let's go to Pokemon Sword. Alrighty, where are they? Here they are. Easy peasy. So, 206 for you. And there's 200. No, that's 190, sorry. There's 200. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So that's one we can put in. Thank you. Alright, Skarmory, what number are you? 227. That's 220. 1, 2, 8, 7. There we are. And Smoochum, what number are you? 238. 
So you'll be right here. And then Magby. 240. Right there. Elekid, you'll be 239. Okay. There we are. And then Blissey, what number are you? 242. So you are here. Got it. And then finally, Kingdra. 230. Uh, 230 is about here, I believe. Because if I'm don't, if I'm right, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. Yep, that's right. And there we are. That is it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please leave a like. And if you want to see more content just like this, where we're going to catch more Hoenn Pokemon next, then please hit the subscribe button to stay up to date with all my videos and more. Thank you guys again, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!